हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू अवर यूट्यूब चैनल मेटोलॉजिकल इंजीनियरिंग टुडे वी विल शो यू सम कॉमर्शियल क्लासिफिकेशंस एंड एप्लीकेशंस ऑफ नॉन फेरस मेटल्स सो द क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ नॉन फेरस मेटल्स इज एज फॉलोज लाइक प्राइमरी मेटल्स सेकेंडरी मेटल्स लाइट मेटल्स प्रेशियस मेटल्स रिफ्रैक्टरी मेटल्स स्कैटर्ड मेटल्स रेडियो एक्टिव मेटल्स रेयर अर्थ एंड फेरोलॉय मेटल्स so first we will see about this primary metals and its applications so the primary metals are cu pb zn sn and ni these are the most common five primary metals which are extensively used and second in important to iron so like first one is copper so what are the applications of this metal first in electrical field second buildings third engineering and transport and fourth there are more other fields in which copper is used extensively second one is lead so in case of batteries it is most commonly used pipes and sheets gasoline additives and alloy and solder next one is zinc so for galvanizing this zinc is mostly used in case of casting that is die casting alloying and sheet and wires the next metal is tin so tin plate in case of soldering alloying and chemicals nickel that is the most common important metal which is used as a high temperature application so this one is the most common application for this one and this nickel is also used in steels stainless steels and non ferrous alloys and electro plating like as i told you high temperature alloys so the high temperature application is turbine blades now we will see the secondary metals and its application so the first secondary metal is antimony so the use of this antimony is batteries pigment chemicals fire retardants rubber and plastics the second one is cobalt so cobalt used for alloying magnets paint dryers ceramics and catalysts and third one is cadmium so for cadmium this plating pigments plastic stabilizers and nickel cadmium batteries the fourth one is mercury so mercury caustic chlorine cells batteries electricals biocidal paints and instruments and dental applications next one is light metals and its application so beryllium is the first one so electrical industry electronic industry nuclear reactors and aerospace the second one is most common that is aluminium so it is used in making structures for buildings automotive and aerospace applications electricals and packaging the third one is magnesium so in this one reducing agent first one is application second one is as oxide for refractories fertilizers and biomedical application the last one is titanium so this is used in the jet engines chemical industry rockets and biomedical implants so this one is the most common important application for this titanium precious metals and its application next one is precious metals and its application so first one is gold that is the uh, most precious metal so gold is uh, mainly used for jewelry and arts dental application space application and defense purposes also next is silver so the silver ware photography electrical fields and bridging and soldering purposes platinum so the use of platinum application is catalyst electrical glass forming dental medical and jewelry the last one is palladium so this used in catalytic converters for cars jewelry dental filling and electricals the next one is refractory metals and its application so first refractory metal is vanadium so it's used in application like ferrous alloys non ferrous alloys catalyst the most common chromium that is a refractory metal so the application of this chromium metal that is stainless steel refractory oxides staining of leather and electroplating next one is molybdenum that is that used in steel industry and chemicals tungsten for tungsten carbides alloy steels electrical lamps and chemicals 
नेक्स्ट इज स्केटर्ड मेटल्स एंड इट्स एप्लीकेशन सो द एप्लीकेशन सेमी कंडक्टर इंडस्ट्रीज न्यूक्लियर रिएक्टर्स एंड फोटो इलेक्ट्रिक सेल्स एंड रिफेक्टिव मेटल्स सो वॉट आर द स्केटर्ड मेटल्स कॉमन स्केटर्ड मेटल्स दैट इज स्केंडियम एस सी आर ई एच एफ दैट इज हैफनियम टी एल टेलोरियम इंडियम गैलियम एंड जर्मेनियम नेक्स्ट इज रेडियो एक्टिव मेटल्स एंड इट्स एप्लीकेशन सो वॉट आर द रेडियो एक्टिव मेटल्स दैट इज पोलोनियम यूरेनियम पेलेडियम थोरियम एक्टीनियम एंड रेडियम सो द एप्लीकेशन ऑफ दीज रेडियो एक्टिव मेटल्स फर्स्ट न्यूक्लियर इंडस्ट्री न्यूक्लियर एनर्जी एंड न्यूक्लियर वेपन्स नेक्स्ट इज रेयर अर्थ मेटल्स एंड इट्स एप्लीकेशन सो द सो दीज आर द कॉमन रेयर अर्थ मेटल्स सो द मोस्ट कॉमन इज इट्रियम and uh, gadolinium and this uh, sm and cerium so the application of these rare earth metals are nuclear industry deoxidizers catalysts portable x-ray sources better x-ray screens fiber optics and synthetic gems so nowadays we are also using this rare earth metals for an alloying additions in aluminium nickel or high temperature application purposes also Next one is ferro alloy metals and its application. So these are the most common four ferro ferro alloy metals. That is chromium, boron, silicon, and manganese. So the applications is alloying elements in steels. Second one is deoxidizers. Third, protective coatings. Then semiconductors, solar cells, and alloying element in aluminium and copper. So one more important metal that is uh, zirconium. is not mentioned anywhere so this is also used as a alloying element and cladding purposes in nuclear application so uh, this much we have covered in this video and uh, apart from this if any other important metal is left please uh, comment in the comment section so please uh, uh, share subscribe and like our video thank you so much